Okay, so future value, as opposed to this, if you're getting present value based on a dollar amount that you know you expect to get certain years from now, you would be referring to the present value table to get what is that certain amount of money you're getting five years from now, 10 years from now, what is it worth as of today? Okay, so if we just rephrase that example, you expect to get 13383 five years from now, and the account interest rate is 6%. So you would trace back that dollar amount, discounted by this present value factor, times the dollar amount that you're expecting to get certain years from now. Okay, so if you trace that back, discounted to current date, the value will be $10,000. So just another way to look at the previous example. Earlier we were talking about depositing $10,000 and then getting this five years from now. Now this is just the opposite of that story, getting this dollar amount and how much does it worth as of today. Okay, so this is again also a one-time investment. Suppose to this you can also